Hello there, good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. So on this video, I'm going to show you how this free AI changed video effects forever. We're going to call it Vigil AI. And basically, this is the main page or website of Vigil AI, because currently it is only available for Discord. So to access the Discord channel or server, click on this option that says join the beta. And if once you clicked it, I'll see you once inside. So welcome back to the video. Right now, this is Vigil AI, and basically what it can do is you upload the photo. Let's just check this example right here. So you upload the photo, you upload a source video, and then the photo will copy the source video itself. Let's try viewing this example right now. As you can see, the photo has copied the video from earlier. That is pretty awesome, right? So let's try making our own. So to enable that, simply type in mix. And as you can see right here, you need to upload an image and a video. So I'm just going to use any random image I got from my PC. I'm going to go with this one. I think this is from Street Fighter or Tekken. Anyway, for the video, I think I'm going to go with this one right here. Now, you'll see that it's an image and an entirely different guy in a video. It should look like this after moving it up. So that photo will be doing this. Let's try and make it happen, okay? So. For the background, make sure this is green screen because if you're going to use it for edit or video editing, it will be useful if it's on green screen. For the fan tune, always turn this on. It will take a bit longer to um, produce or give you the output, but the quality is superb. Anyway, once you click enter one now, I'll get back to you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. Right now, here's our output. Again, guys, this is going to be the photo that we got. This is going to be the video. And of course, here's the output. Pretty awesome, right? I know it's not perfect. We're still seeing some um, output right there. Or the video has been blending not quite well. But come on, it's really good, right? Anyway, that is how you use it. Basically, that's how you do it. However, I found a way to make it more better. So if you check my example right here, let me just pull them up. So let's check this basically a woman jogging, a plain video, and what if I told you I can make her look an alien, like this one right here. Pretty awesome, right? This is all in Vigil. As you can see, there is a watermark on that video right there, but basically that is Vigil for you. I'm going to teach you how to do this from scratch, so let's try remaking the exact video that I made. The things that we're going to need is these two websites. I'm going to take you them right now. So the very first one that we're going to need is Runway ML. I have a video about this one, so please check it out if you're not familiar on making it. Next up, we're going to need the LensGo AI. It's, it should be this one. Now, LensGo AI is another AI tool that I've used. And I have a video about this, so please check it out also. And now let's go back to Runway. Now once you're back in Runway, click on Video Edit or Edit Videos right there. And make sure you click on In Painting. And it will take you on this platform. As you can see, I already have some projects here that has been going on before. But I'm going to upload the video here. I'm going to choose, of course, the video I got. The source video. The plain woman jogging. By the way, I got that from Pexels and Pixabay, so please check them out. Those are free websites to download any video or stock footage you need. So, we're almost done here uploading. As you can see right there, it's already finished. What I'm going to do right now is basically drag it on the timeline. Once it's fully dragged in and everything is good to go, you'll see this right section that says include and exclude. Make sure you're in include. You can just adjust the price size, whatever you want, and basically just cover everything. Imagine if this is just a painting. If you're familiar with Canva, you're familiar with Paint or Photoshop, I think even Da Vinci has this option right here. So I'm just going to cover everything. You see what I'm going with this, right? I'm trying to make this contact or the person disappear in the video. Now, this is only available for free in Runway ML, but for editors that are, for example, video editing platform that are for paid subscription, especially Photoshop, this is going to be for a paid feature. So you have three trials for your free account in Runway ML. So I think I'm almost done here just to add some finishing touches and then simple button, just release the mouse. Now it's currently including the painting, removing the person or the woman in the video. And it will take around a minute or two 
And there we have it. So once you're finished with this one, simply click on export right there, export the video. And then you'll see right here that on this part that says go to export, click on it right now. So right here, this is the part where you'll see all of your export. It's just like your gallery or some sort. Anyway, this will take a few minutes. So I'm just going to use the stock video, the one I did earlier with the um, example. We're just going to use that one, okay? Now let's go back on the other website. So right now, we're going to use LensGo AI. Before you proceed on this one, make sure you have a screenshot of your video. What I mean by screenshot is if you open your video right there, post it in a part where everything is good in a frame, Um, take a screenshot of the woman like so, click save, click save right there. And basically, we're going to use that as a reference image. So go to create images right now. As you can see, I have a lot of images going on here. Make sure you upload the reference that you got from earlier and basically have a prompt. This prompt right here would be by your own preference. It doesn't really mean that you have to copy the everything I type here, but it's really free and it's okay for me that if you copy this one. Anyway, click on generate right now and you'll see right here, it's currently generating. But I'm still going to use this one, the pink one that I did from earlier. It's much more better looking and the uh, Close is similar to the one on the source video, right? Anyway, let's move on now to Discord. Just make sure you download this first on this button right there. And I'll see you in Discord. Now, once we have all of the things we need to create a video in Discord, again, same process. Click on Mix. Choose the one from LensGo AI. So let me just enlarge the photos here so you can check them. So this is the one we have, right? I'm going to get it right there for the video. I'm going to choose now the one that is a stock video, this one right here with a person. So it will really help Vigil AI to determine where do I want to put that reference image. Again, the, for the background, please choose green if you're going to edit it later, which I'm going to do. For the fine tune, of course, click on. Click on enter. i will get back to you once it's here. So welcome back to the video. Right now, this is the one we use as a photo reference, right? This one right here. This is the video that we use as a source video that I got from Pexels. And this is going to be our final output as of now. Now, we're going to use this one for an editing platform later on. Make sure you click on download right there. And now let's move on and combine them all together. So we're going to use Filmora for this option right here. It's a paid editing platform that I got personally. But if you can use CapCut, that is entirely free. Any editing platform is okay with this one, as long as it supports green screen manipulation. Please take note about that one. So I'll see you once Filmora is here. So welcome back to the video. Right now, this is what it looks like inside Filmora. And now we're just going to combine the two videos. So I'm just going to choose the one from Discord and one from Runway ML, the one we where we removed it and basically add them both up. So basically right there, just apply the green screen option, the chroma key. This is very important. That's why we've utilized the green screen option. With one simple click of a button, there we have it. Now if you play right there, this is how it should look like. Pretty awesome, right? And by the way guys, one simple thing to do here is basically export it on this option right there, name it, and it should look like this. So this is going to be the final output of our video. If I play right there, it's going to be like, like this. Pretty awesome, right? From a very basically a woman, a human basically, and now a blue face alien. And with that being said, thank you so much for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Goodbye for now.